his defense. To the future the hope is that this will be just one of many new additions to the fleet further bolstering the country's defense posture with the rocks and on joining the ranks the Philippine Navy is not only expanding its fleet but also its ability to defend the nation's vast maritime territories this ship represents a significant step forward in the modernization of the armed forces of the Philippines ensuring that the country remains ready and capable in the face of any challenge in conclusion the addition of the rocks and on to the Philippine Navy is more than just an enhancement of the fleet it is a symbol of strategic empowerment a commitment to protecting the nation's sovereign and a testament to the growing strength of the Philippines on the world stage as we welcome this new corvette let us remain steadfast in our support for the continued modernization of our naval forces knowing that each new ship brings us closer to a safer and more secure future the ship is also armed with mistal missiles for short-range air defense as well as harpoon anti-ship missiles known for their effectiveness in neutralizing surface threats at longer range but the rocks and on arsenal doesn't stop there it also carries lightweight torpedoes designed for anti-submarine warfare and anti-submarine bombs further enhancing its capabilities against underwater threats this comprehensive suite of weapons ensures that the rocks and on can effectively counter a wide range of threats from enemy ships to submarines making it a vital asset in the protection of the Philippines maritime interests the rocks and on measures 88.3 meters in length and 10 meters in width making it a compact yet highly capable vessel with a top speed of 32 knots it is also one of the fastest ships in the Philippine Navy allowing it to respond rapidly to emerging threats or emergencies its design and capabilities make it the Philippine Navy is set to make another significant leap in its maritime defense capability with the forthcoming arrival of the rocks and on a state-of-the-art corvette from South Korea this marks the second ship of its class to join the Philippine fleet following the retirement and transfer of the rocks Chung Jae-yu now proudly serving as the BRP Conrado Yap the rocks and on is not just another ship it represents a strategic enhancement in the Navy's ability to patrol and secure the vast and often contested waters of the Philippine archipelago specifically designed for coastal defense this corvette is equipped with a formidable array of weaponry and ADV advanced systems tailored to address a wide range of maritime threats the Rox Andong is a versatile vessel that is designed to excel in a variety of maritime operations from routine patrols to high-stakes defense scenarios with a full displacement of 1,200 tons this corvette can accommodate a crew of 100 ensuring that it is well manned for any mission it undertakes in terms of armament the Rox Andong is no lightweight it is equipped with a 76mm naval gun capable of delivering powerful fire against both surface and air targets complementing this is a 40mm cannon providing additional firepower for close-range engagements. Particularly well suited for patrolling the Philippines' extensive coastline which stretches over 36,000 kilometers with its advanced sensors and weaponry the rocks and on will play a crucial role in monitoring and securing the country's maritime territory particularly in areas that are prone to incursions or disputes the addition of the rocks and on to the Philippine fleet is not just about acquiring another ship it is a clear demonstration of the country's commitment to modernizing its military forces and enhancing its maritime defense capabilities alongside the BRP Conrado Yap which has already proven its value in various naval exercises and patrols the rocks and on will further strengthen the Navy's ability to protect the Philippines' sovereign waters this acquisition is part of a broader strategy to ensure that the Philippine Navy is well equipped to face the challenges of the two-stone century as the Philippines continues to navigate a complex and often contentious maritime environment having a robust and capable Navy is essential for safeguarding the nation's interests and maintaining regional stability the arrival of the rocks and on is a cause for celebration but it also highlights the ongoing need for continued investment in the country's naval capabilities.